Hello guys, this is Alex from Chicago. Today we're gonna talk about the most common mistake people make when they install 240 volt heaters. When they install one, there's no problem, but when they install two or more, that's when the problem comes. So today I'm gonna take a step-by-step -step how I found the problem and what I did to fix it. Stay at the end because I'm gonna show you some electrical pictorials so you understand the electrical concept better. So don't go anywhere, I'll be right back. So here I have, I'm calling for heat and if you see right here this, that means that it's on. So these are the two heaters. We have one heater here and one heater there. there. You see there are, two, there are two heaters, one there and one there. But when I touch the heaters, they are barely warm. They are warm, and eventually, if if you run them for a long time, it's gonna be the, the room is gonna get warmer. But it's not hot enough. It has to be hot to the touch, where you touch it and you know that it's hot. You know right away, but it's not happening. So we wanna find out why is doing that and I know why but I'm gonna take you step by step and show you what's wrong with these heaters so now we want to look for the power source I'm gonna see if I see something underneath you will see the power where the power comes from and I see my flex right there do you see it so the power starts here okay so since we know that so just so you know there's two heaters there are two heaters one here and one there we have an access panel there another one there another one there And another one here so the power comes from down there let's turn the power off to the breaker so we're gonna remove these and we're gonna expose and you see here this is the access panel for the electric so we're gonna remove this and this is the wiring so the yellow wires bring the power and this this heater is connected here we have to open up this So the power comes from there and is connected with the first heater. And then this heater is connected to the next heater in series, you see? So this is wrong. We have to remove these. We have to remove this and this. What we're gonna do, we separated this and this. So this is gonna be together. Okay, so this, we use the two wires are connected one and from here we're gonna run two more wires two different wires that are gonna go all the way there so uh, we have to hide the wires either under here but then you see them or up here but they burn 
So this one is designed, if you see there, there's a hole, there's a channel where the wire goes. So that wire from there comes through here all the way to here. So I'm gonna try to put my two wires that come from here to the other heater through here and then through this hole and then I'm gonna try to push them inside. So what I did, and I'm gonna use the existing wire, this one that belongs to this heater, I'm gonna use it as to pull the wire. So I did three wires, and then I'm gonna, add, we just need two wires, two blue wires, but we're gonna use the third one to bring this back here so we can loop it here. So, Mao from there, is gonna pull that black wire there. He's gonna pull it there. And then I'm gonna push it through here. Despacito. And now we're gonna return the black one original. So we're gonna connect it to any blue wire and then we wanna pull it. So now I'm returning my black original one. Okay, so this is okay, so this is what I did. This is the loop for this heater. And then this heater, I'm connected from here, the blue wire, and it goes through here, through there, all the way there to the blue. So now I'm gonna grab one power and then this black from this heater here and then a blue from the other heater. So we have three. On a wire knot and put it away and then another another the yellow wire with the black from this heater and then the blue from the other heater Let's try again. We just turn it on and let's see. I can feel the heat right away. They are hot. So is this one. So we're good. I can <laughs> I can smell the heat the elements burning harder for the first time in 30 years. So in this pictorial, I'm gonna show you the connection in series, which is wrong, and the connection in parallel, which is optimal. So we have the electrical breaker, we have the four wire thermostat, heater one and heater two. So usually uh, we have 240 volts, so one hot wire, 120, goes 
to line one right there. And then the other hot wire, 120 goes to L2. That's 240 volts because we have 120 and 120. And then from the load side of the thermostat, so first let me, um, these are the wires from the heater. Okay, so from here, there you are gonna connect one to here from the load and then one to here. Usually when this is one of the heaters, uh, these are connected together. But since we have two heaters, they disconnected both sides and then connect them together. So now these two heaters are connected in, ser in parallel, in series. So what happened is that 240, 240 volts come here, but then since you have two heaters and they're connected in series, they only gonna get 120 volts each. So that's why they don't get hot. They get warm, but they don't get hot. So now I'm gonna show you. So Sirius, connected in Sirius, no. It's a no, no. You're gonna get just half of the heat. Now let's connect them in parallel. So we have 120 from one, connected to L1 of the four wire thermostat. And then the other hat, we're gonna connect it here to L2. And then from the low side, that's gonna go to the heaters. So we're gonna take one load hot one. We're gonna put it here. And then the other one from the low side, we're gonna put it here. And now, heater one, we have a hundred, we have these wires here, so we're gonna connect it to here, and then connect it to here. And then these wires, if you see here, they're connected to the other heater. These wires, we're gonna connect them together. And you put a, you're gonna put a wire nut here. And then these wires at the end of the heater are gonna be connected in a nut wire, but these two, you are not going to, you are not going to connect them to these. What we're gonna do, we're gonna grab these, we're gonna have another one from here, from the source, all the way to here. So this one is gonna go all the way to this one. So the first heater is gonna get, is gonna be connected to the source. And then the second heater is gonna be connected to the source directly. So this way, the first heater here is gonna get 240 volts. And the second heater, which is connected to the source of the power, is gonna get 240 volts as well. And it's gonna be hot. Both heaters are gonna get hotter. So connected in parallel, that's the way to go. Okay, guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you liked and enjoy the video. I hope it was useful to you. I hope you understand better how to connect two heaters or more. So I'll catch you later. Have a good one. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.